I'm in our problem segment tonight. The far left continues to demonize the Tea Party as a racist outfit, and this has been going on for months, as you know. A column today in the Wall Street Journal says the racist deal is a political strategy that the Democratic Party needs because minority voters have to be with them, and if they don't get them, they're in big trouble. It's a pretty tough charge. You're saying the Democratic Party has to have the minority votes, and in order to keep them in the flock, they're willing to use the racist charge. You know that for sure? When you don't vote, you allow another cross to burn. When you don't vote, you let another assault wound a brother or sister. When you don't vote, you let the Republicans continue to cut school lunches and hit start. When you don't vote, you allow the Republicans to give tax breaks to the wealthy while threatening Social Security and Medicare. You vote, and you elect Democrats who want to strengthen Social Security and Medicare, make classes smaller by hiring 100,000 new teachers, and repair and rebuild public schools. When you vote, you elect Democrats committed to a patient's bill of rights that lets us, not the insurance companies, make choices about our health care. Voting will change things for the better. On November 3rd, vote. Vote smart. Vote Democratic for Congress and U.S. Senate. George Bush doesn't care about black people.